In our baptismal covenant, we vow to continue in the apostles' teaching and fellowship the breaking of the bread and the prayers. None of us can fulfill this promise on our own. We rely on one another in Christian community to help us live into this promise. Each week, members of St. Mark's teach classes, bake bread, make coffee, and serve as servants of worship in dozens of different ways. Together, we make church. Today, we're taking an opportunity. Aunt Marcel Barros, one of the many members of St. Mark's who helps us live more deeply into this promise each week. Hello, I am Marceliano Marcel Barros. I want to share about me and my journey with Christ. It goes like this. First I felt love. That was my first taste of God. I just felt it. I was about two or three. Then I felt there was a presence outside of myself. That is when I started to pray. Prayer helps me keep perspective on my life. Not talking much makes it easier to listen and pray. Prayer comes easily to me. It is one of my blessings from God. I have always thought of God as love. I am filled with love by God so I always have love in my heart. This is one of my spiritual gifts. I am able to love all people. I searched for church for years. When I finally found Reverend Rhonda and San Gabriel's in 2014, my heart grew so much and my relationship with Christ exploded, too. I acolyte there, crucifer and lector. My growth in Christ really took off. First time I have communion was at San Gabriel from Reverend Rhonda. Best gift ever. I feel Christ flow in my body. I feel so much I don't know where I am. Suddenly I am not lonely for God anymore. I got that gift. It made me. I try give that gift of Holy Spirit now too. I get confirmed by San Gabriel's in 2015. Being welcomed and accepted by that congregation really gave me confidence in my relationship with Christ. With confidence, my joy spills out of me. I have received so much kindness and compassion from God I just cheer it. I feel that my relationship with Christ lifts me up. Contributing to church is a way for me to give back to others all the blessings I have gotten. I am so happy here St. Mark's. Marcel's deepest joy comes from serving at the altar and drawing near to the living presence of Christ in the Eucharist. But Marcel's commitment to St. Mark's goes far beyond his ministry as a servant of worship to include a daily commitment to prayer and service. I have joy participate here. I pray daily prayer list for St. Mark's and San Gabriel. Sunday I go online service. Tuesday I go rosary group. Thursday I go in person, lead silent prayer group, crucifer for service, and volunteer in office. I am grateful for Christ here at St. Mark's. I am so happy to get to know you all. Thank you. Marcel graduated from Cibola High School in 2018 and joined St. Mark's in 2020. He lives with his family in Corrales. Even outside the church, Marcel strives to live in accordance with our baptismal vow to proclaim by word and example the good news of God in Christ. Proclaiming the good news of Christ by word can be a challenge for Marcel, since the adaptive technology that Marcel uses to speak and write can't begin to keep pace with his sharp, quick intellect. But limited access to conventional spoken language doesn't keep Marcel from building relationships and communicating his deep faith through his facial expressions, vocalizations, eye contact, directional gaze, and his very presence. Ask any of Marcel's family members or friends if you need some tips on how best to begin a conversation with Marcel. Proclaiming the good news of Christ by example, on the other hand, is second nature for Marcel. 
Marcel embodies the good news when he's cycling, horseback riding, skiing, canoeing, and enjoying the great outdoors, listening to country music and going to concerts, training assistance dogs, bringing homemade blueberry pancakes to friends for celebration and support, painting murals with his feet, working for social justice through participation in protests, demonstrations, and advocacy campaigns, spending time with his mom, Stephanie, dad, Joseph, and younger sister, Sophia. In addition to being an avid Cowboys fan, Marcel is a fan of all of you, the members and friends of St. Mark's, and looks forward to building deep relationships with each one of you in the coming years. Together, let us renew the promises made at baptism. Will you continue in the apostles' teaching and fellowship, the breaking of the bread and the prayers? I will with God's help. Will you proclaim by word and example the good news of God in Christ? I will with God's help. Spirit, Spirit.